Hey, what's up, what's up? It's your boy, A to the K to the K, Alexander King Kwame. Welcome to Hoodie Studios. So today, we are going to talk about how to fix your textures in Unreal Engine. I, actually, I got this problem some time ago, and I thought it was just me just having that problem. But I solved it. So um, now I know um, people are also running into the same um, problem but it's not actually a problem it's just about fixing something so so without not wasting much time let's just get into it all right so i'm in marvelous designer and i have my um hoodie here and um i have my textures on so you can see you can see what i've got here so i i want to send this into um unreal engine and to show you um how to get this what the um the quality you see here in unreal engine because i've realized people do struggle um about getting this quality actually when you you do um fbx or obj you won't get this problem i don't know but you you're not gonna get um that problem but mostly when you do olympic files you have um, your simulation going on and you you do it on olympic file you get you tend to get that problem so it's not only about the textures from marvelous design about maybe from substance painter or from mari or quixel mixer you will still get that problem if you don't fix your textures okay so here you just go to file and you just go to export and um alembic and you just yeah you just export your alembic so we are gonna jump into our real engine and I'm gonna show you how to fix it all right okay so I will just go down and I will go look for my Olympic actually I made two actually I will add another one later but let's let me show you these two first so you see this hoodie right here so this hoodie is um, hoodie, hoodie 10 and I have hoodie 100 but just pay attention at this point so you can see we have static mesh i'll change it to geometry cache and this is the main um thing right here compressed texture coordinates number blah 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 this one is the whole setting so let me, let's let's do a test so i'll place this one at one um let me see if i can do zero because i don't know can we do zero oh, okay we cannot do zero so we can do one and uh, I will just change it to Autodex 3ds Max and I'll just import it. So it's in. And anyways, that's um, the snow that you see is just an HDRI. So yeah. So that is it. So I will just save it. And I will bring in the um, Hoodie 100. So this is the one I'm going to give a quality texture to. So we already, we already have we already have geometry cache and I'll just scroll down and add a compressed texture blah 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 I will change it to 30. So this one is gonna give us um the perfect quality. So we already have it and I'll just import it. So after I import them, mostly I always keep saving my project uh, every, every time. so i will just drag in the texture because when you export your olympic from unreal not from marvelous you just um get a chance to export your diffuse map so i did that but here i will come to quixel um, um mega scans and i'll just go in for a fabric texture because i'm gonna use that to um texture my um hoodies so i'll place this one in and so i will double click on the textures and it will open up and i'll go to the mega scans folder so i'm actually dropping in the normal map and i'll connect it to the normal and this is the ambient occlusion roughness and displacement and all i just need is the roughness map so i will click drag the roughness map into the roughness 
and I will just um, search for texture coordinate because I want to tell my UV so texture coordinate and I'll bring in a constant and I'll bring in a multiply node so I will plug the texture coordinates into the A and the um, constant into the B and I'll make it 100 and I'll just hit them place them into the UVs of the um, normal and the uh, amir occlusion and the roughness map so I'll just apply and this is where everything gets interesting so I place this one on the hundred remember we made the texture blah 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 yeah that thing we made it one so this is what we got we got black we didn't get anything crazy but this one we got the, this one is why we made it 30 if you remember so this is where um, you know the main problem is coming from the texture um, you know blah 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 <laughs> anyway yeah you know what I'm talking about so yeah so you just have to um, make sure you set it right so actually we can um, test it again with uh, another um, alembic file so right right now we have two so I will just um, click this one and control C control V and I will name um so let me just click this one here and i'll just name this um this 50. so i'll have to go into unreal and i will bring in that 50 alembic file in here so and in this one i'm not gonna make it 30 that um compressed texture and um, coordinate i'm not gonna make it dirty i'm gonna make it five so you see the effect this will also bring and i will drag it in i just copy and i'll just paste the location So I'll bring it into the middle side and um, I just copy the rotation and I'll paste the rotation. So just like that. So now when I place the texture on it, you see what we got? <laughs> you see like from 1, 5, 30. So the whole thing is all about your compressed texture um, setting so you just have to boost that let me try and um, add some light so um, y'all can actually um, see what's going on so I will make this quick because it's kind of kind of dark so I'll just make it quick and um, I just bring this light down so you now you can see you can see the first one is dark but it's the same texture you understand it's the same texture but the second one is uh, it, it was trying to kind of bring in in the texture but it wasn't able to do it and the third one just did it so yeah that's um, actually it so that's how you do it you know so if you got any um, questions just drop it in the comment section and let me know what's up don't forget to like don't forget to subscribe peace stay blessed um take care i'm out all right bye